Hello again. It's been a little while since we had a video, so I felt compelled to do something. I've uh, been away on travelling on business. I'm about to go away on holiday, so there'll be another break. Um, so I thought I'd throw together and do a quick rush demo of something I've been working on recently. Um, it combines the Adafruit 2.2 inch TFT display um, that you might have seen an article from Jeremy um, using. Um, it involves using some kernel drivers uh, to give you a frame buffer. Um, that you can then write to using anything in Linux land that supports frame buffers. So in this particular case, Pygame. Um, so I've been working with uh, a little IC called an MPU 6050 by Invincense. Um, and on board that you've got an accelerometer and a gyroscope. Um, I'm still working on getting the gyroscope working at the moment, but I've got the accelerometer aspect of that going right now. Um, I think it supports 2G, 4G, 8G and 16G modes. Um, a bit over the top for today, so it's just in 2G mode. Um, and I thought I'd show you a little, do a bit of a drive around in the car, um, showing some of the data in, I don't know, about 14 frames a second or something at a push um, on the little TFT display. So our dot in the center um, should get larger and smaller based on the forces in our Z axis. So as we go over any bumps, you should see that varying in size. Um, as you can see, when we experience force in any direction, as it becomes more extreme, the background changes from green through to red. So if we accelerate now, we should see our dot head further back in the circle. And as we brake, it should travel further forwards. So let's see if we can get the dot to move left and right again. 